Hello everyone, my name is Glenowen and today I'm gonna make a small vlog, like a short vlog. And in this vlog, I'm gonna explain you like uh, any stuff that has a physics applicable stuff, like sort of light bulbs and water dispensers, and so more. And alright, let's get started. I'm gonna show you yes how does a Hello Kitty water dispenser works like you see when I when I put a glass in here then I press this lever the water comes out you may wonder how does that water come out from that dispenser let me tell you, most water dispensers works by having a container upside down, just like this. And then, because of this, this allows gravity and vacuum pressure to do the job. The job is to filling a glass when someone presses the lever, just like what I did. And when this happens, air is allowed into the container so that the water from the container can escape and then come to this glass now i'm gonna show you the other stuff now to the next room i'm gonna explain you about how does the light bulb work like you see this light bulb has no lights but then when i turn a button it glows now maybe some of you don't know and some of you already already know like how does the light bulb turns on like how does it glow what makes it glow well to make it simple the light bulb turns electric energy into light energy and it turns light energy by sending an electric current through a thin wire which is called filaments now this filament is mostly made out of tungsten metals and now I'm gonna explain you how does it glow just like that now this filament has a resistance and this resistance will make the filaments heat will heat the bulbs and then eventually the filaments will get so hot until it glows like for example I'm gonna turn it on you see like it's glowy because it's it's hot in there in the inside of the light bulbs and then since it's hot like it's really hot it will go on like that and that's for the light bulbs next I'm gonna explain you to the other stuff that is relatable to physics Alright, next it's still in my room. What I'm gonna show you is a guitar. Maybe maybe some of you will be thinking, what does a guitar do in everyday physics? Well, it's simple. As you can see, when you strike this string right here, it makes sounds. Now, how does this sound produced by this guitar? Well, the answer is simple. This sound is produced by striking the strings and make them vibrate. As you can see right here, when you watch it closely, it's, it's vibrating right there. Then when this vibrate, this energy of this fi vibrating strings is transferred to the soundboard through the bridge, like through here. Then, the guitar's hollow body amplifies the sound of the vibrating strings. That's it for, our, for my first vlog. I hope you enjoy this video. And I'm gonna see you in the next project making. Goodbye!